Hello everyone, you are welcome. Today we have a new exponential math problem which is 6 raised to power a minus 5 raised to power a is equal to 11. So here we will try to find out the value of a. Now how can we solve this math problem? So let's start our solution. Now first of all here we can write these two powers as this will become 6 is to power a but a can be written as a by 2 times 2 the head 2 and 2 will be cancelled and this will become a minus 5 plus to power a will become a by 2 times 2 is equal to 11 the head in both the terms we will use an exponential identity so here in this step we will use this one exponential identity a raised to power m times n which can also be written as a raised to power m whole raised to power n. So using this identity here, this step hand side will become this will become 6 raised to power a by 2 whole square minus this will become 5 raised to power a by 2 whole square is equal to 11. We're looking to the left hand side here, this left hand side is in algebraic form a square minus b square. So here in this step we will use this one algebraic identity a square minus b square which is equal to a minus b times a plus b. So using this identity here the step hand side will become this will become 6 s to power a by 2 minus 5 s to power a by 2 times 6 s to power a by 2 plus Five to power a by two is equal to eleven. Here we can write this eleven as eleven can be written as one times eleven or eleven times one. But looking to the left hand side here for any integer, positive integer or natural number a, this a by two will be a positive number. And for any number in the power here. The sum of these two numbers will be always greater than their difference. So here, therefore here this expression will be smaller than this one expression for the any value of a, positive value of a. So therefore here this one pair of number, this one factors best matches with this hand side. So here we will take this one pair and we will reject this one. So next we can write this as this will become 6 s to power a by 2 minus 5 raised to power a by 2 times 6 raised to power a by 2 plus 5 raised to power a by 2 is equal to 1 times 11. And we will take this expression equal to 1 and this expression equal to 11. So from here we will get so we become 6 raised to power a by 2 minus 5 raised to power a by 2 is equal to 1 and 6 s to power a by 2 plus 5 raised to power a by 2 is equal to 11. Let's suppose this is our equation number first and this is our equation number second. Then we will add these two equations. So this will become this will become 6 s to power a by 2 minus 5 raised to power a by 2 is equal to 1 and 6 s to power a by 2 plus 5 raised to power a by 2 is equal to 11. So by summing these two numbers here this negative 5 raised to power a by 2 and this will be cancelled and this will become 2 times 6 raised to power a by 2 is equal to 1 plus 11 is simply 12. Here we will divide both sides by 2. So this 2 and this 2 will be cancelled. 2 times 1 is 2. 2 times 6 is 12. So this becomes 6. So this equation becomes 6 raised to power a by 2 is equal to 6. Look at both sides here and both sides the bases are same. So here we will compare their powers. So this gives him a by 2 is equal to 1. Let's take this 2 to the right hand side. So this becomes a is equal to 1 times 2 is 2. 
so finally a is equal to 2 is our answer and value of a and this beautiful exponential math formula and we'll try to verify the value of a it is a is equal to 2 is the exact and correct solution of this equation or not so we'll verify this value here To verify the value of a here, here we will rewrite our problem again. So our problem is 6 raised to power a minus 5 raised to power a is equal to 11. So here a is 2, so this becomes 6 raised to power 2 minus 5 raised to power 2 is equal to 11. 6 raised to power 2 is simply 6 times 6 is 36 minus 5 times 5 is 25 is equal to 11 now 36 minus 25 is above this is 11 is equal to 11 since both sides are equal so it means that a is equal to 2 is the exact and correct value of a and solution of this interesting exponential math problem and last, don't forget to subscribe my YouTube channel for such a more interesting and step-by-step -step math solutions. Thanks for watching.